conversion between meter and centimeter is very important. So let's look at its application in word problems. So Sam got a piece of cloth which is 4 meters long. Find the length of cloth in centimeters. So here we need to find the length of cloth in centimeters and the length given is in meters that is 4 meters. Now we know that 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeters isn't it? So now we need to find 4 meters in centimeter that is we need to find the value of 4 meters in centimeters. So how do we do that? Well what do we know? We know that when we convert from a larger unit to a smaller unit that is here we are converting from meter to centimeter. Now meter is a larger unit and centimeter is a smaller unit. So we are converting from meter to centimeter that is larger to smaller unit. So what do we do? We multiply and what do we multiply? We multiply this number with the conversion number that is how many centimeters is a meter? Well it's 100 centimeters. So we'll multiply 4 with 100. So 4 into 100 centimeters. So we can write 4 meters as 4 into 100 centimeters which is 400 centimeters. So this is the answer which we are looking for. So the length of the cloth is 400 centimeters and we converted it using the trick that is when we convert from larger unit to a smaller unit then we multiply. Now Arnab placed five pieces of wood of length 20 centimeter each from one end to the other. So how long are the pieces of wood all together in meters? So what exactly did he do? Well he placed 20 centimeters each wood pieces, five of them. So we can say that one, two, three, four and five. So he placed five of them end to end and each one of them is 20 centimeters. And now we need to find the entire length of this from here to here and that in meters. So what do we have? Five pieces of wood of length 20 centimeters each. So 20 centimeters into 5 isn't it? So total length is 100 centimeters that is if you add the length of all the sticks then the entire length is 100 centimeter. Now what do we need to do? We need to convert this into meters isn't it? Now what do we know? What is 100 centimeters? The conversion is 100 centimeters is equal to 1 meter, isn't it? So if the entire length is 100 centimeters, that means that the entire length is 1 meter. So the pieces of wood all together are 1 meter long. So that is our final answer. So what did we see here? We saw conversion of meter to centimeter and vice versa and its application in word problems. Now you saw two such problems here and you can practice more problems till you become perfect. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can also register for free at deltastep.com to get all learning resources as per ICSE, CBSE, IB, Cambridge or any other curriculum. Over 5000 amazing lectures across 
maths, science, English and social science. Our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests. Performance analysis along with actionable feedback. Personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts. That's not all. You also get amazing prizes like PlayStations, iPads, watches and many more along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So at deltastep.com, learning is not just fun and easy, it's rewarding too. So register for free now.